So today we're back with my European night crawler bin. And as you recall, we fed them um, last week, about eight days ago, I think, maybe nine. So I think I'm going to start getting this bin ready for harvesting. The last time I checked on it, it had a lot of uh, finished castings. And it is recommended that if you want your population to increase, you either split the bin, which of course I'm not going to do. This is a very large bin and I'm not going to, to split it. Uh, or do frequent harvesting. And since this bin has been going for about five months, four or five months, I believe, there is plenty of uh, ready compost for me to harvest. So let us uh, look in on the guys and see what they're up to. So we fed on this side, we fed the egg cartons with food. And you can see that the bottom there, it's really nice and composted. So that's what I'm talking about. Yeah, I definitely think this bin is ready for, for harvesting. It's very deceptive on, on camera because it's very deep. It's actually very, very deep. And <clears throat> none of my bins have drainage holes. And as you can see, um, it's nice, moist castings, but no standing liquid, no foul smells. Um, So when I get a bin ready for harvesting, first I stop feeding it and I just let the worms work through whatever they still have left, both bedding and uh, food waste. Nice big chunky worms. I did see some babies in there as well, so I know they're reproducing. They certainly have the room and the conditions for it. Here is like, here is a youngster. Yeah, so it looks really nice, really in good condition. And they are spread out, as you can see, throughout the bin. Not just any one particular spot. Ooh. Oh, this is interesting. I wonder what they're doing over here. Don't have any food here. Oh, look at all that. I guess something here they like. I have no idea what it is. You can see they're happy, they're healthy.
and the compost is moist and dark and rich. Oh, God, I, I never get enough of looking at these guys. They are so chunky and large. No, 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 don't go anywhere. They are not happy with me right now because I was messing with them and they don't like it. Okay, so I'm going to just leave this bin alone and um, about once, once a day I will come and I will just kind of fluff up the compost, uh, just get it a little bit drier, preparing it for uh, for harvesting and then I will move um, once I'm ready uh, but probably two weeks I will not feed this bin for two weeks and once I'm ready I'm going to move all the contents to one side and just feed the other side giving the worms plenty of time to migrate to the, the new side with the food leaving me the uh, the majority of the castings worm free and uh, I'll bring you along for that so yeah thanks for joining me